The following is a summary of the Holy Father's words this morning. Dear brothers and sisters, I thank the Lord for the grace of my recent visit to Georgia and Azerbaijan, and I renew my gratitude to the civil and religious authorities of both countries, in particular to the Patriarch of all Georgia, Elia II, and to the Sheikh of the Muslims of the Caucasus. This visit complemented my visit to Armenia in June and fulfilled my desire to visit all three nations of the Caucasus to confirm the Catholic community and to encourage all the people in their journey toward peace and fraternity. Though Georgia and Azerbaijan enjoy ancient, historical, cultural, and religious roots, they have only just celebrated 25 years of independence and are experiencing great challenges. The Catholic Church is called to be close to them, especially through works of charity and by promoting the good of the human person in communion with the other churches and Christian communities and in dialogue with other religious communities. In Georgia, our cooperation is naturally with our Orthodox brothers and sisters, and so Patriarch Elia's presence at the airport upon my arrival was a very important sign, as well as our visit to the Patriarchal Cathedral and our meeting, which was very moving. Our unity is seen in the blood of so many Christian martyrs of different Christian confessions, especially the Assyrian Chaldean, with whom we prayed for peace in Syria, Iraq, and the whole Middle East. In Azerbaijan, a primarily Muslim country, I was able to participate in an interreligious meeting and to celebrate Mass with a small Catholic community. Our communion of faith inspires us to deepen our dialogue and encounter with all those who believe in God so that together we can build a more just and fraternal world. May God bless Armenia, Georgia, and Azerbaijan and guide his holy people in those countries. The Holy Father will now greet the English-speaking visitors and pilgrims in Italian. Saluto i pellegrini di lingua inglese presenti all'odierna udienza, specialmente quelli provenienti da Inghilterra, Scozia, Irlanda, Norvegia, Australia, Cina, Indonesia, Malaysia, Filippine e Stati Uniti d'America. Su tutti voi e sulle vostre famiglie invoco la misericordia e la pace del Signore pregando che condividiate questi doni con tutti quelli che incontrerete. Dio vi benedica. I greet the English-speaking pilgrims and visitors taking part in today's audience, especially those from England, Scotland, Ireland, Norway, Australia, China, Indonesia, Malaysia, the Philippines, and the United States of America. Upon all of you, I invoke the mercy and peace of the Lord, praying that you may share these gifts with all whom you encounter. May God bless you and your families. Domino hoiscum, et cum spiritu tuo, sin nomen domini benedictum, Ex hoc nunc et usque in seculum. Aiutorium nostrum in nomine Domini. Qui fece celum et terram. Benedicat vos, omnipotens Deus, Pater et Filius et Spiritus Sancti. Amen. Amen. 